Yeah, man, shouts out to V1 Visions. Hey, look, V1 Visions, if you ain't watching that, then you ain't watching shit, nigga. See in my bag, man? You say you used to chop out the store, like, right? that's some real nigga shit. How'd that go? No cat, like, I mean, shit just fast, though. Like, nah, I mean, niggas that hit licks, goddamn, seraphines and shit in the store, like, Know what I mean? Like anything I drop or sing about or rap, whatever nigga wanna call, what I do, you feel me? Like all, all that shit straight facts, you feel me? Cause like I said, I grew up from nothing, so you feel me? Like any little thing that I had, I made that shit happen on my own. Like because I had a goddamn kick a dough, do whatever, you feel me? All, it was just about a dollar, about me, really, you feel me? And just making sure me and mine are straight other than that, though, you feel me? They get in my bag, that shit was tough, though, man, bro. We gotta start dropping more together anyway, but you feel me? That mm, shit, bro. Who you talking about? Oh, that loco, you feel me? Like, that shit, it really came from too, you feel me? Because it's like, I just had to let niggas know, like, nigga, I'm in my bag now, you feel me? Like, so, now I mean? So when I drop that, I was just letting niggas know, like, when I finally do drop some solo shit, bro, my shit gonna be like that, and I'm gonna really be in my bag on that shit. Alright, so, uh, you said, so you going hard at this music? You yeah, starting to take it yeah, serious? Yeah, I'm taking it serious, bro, because I see what it can take me if I stop bullshitting, you feel me? Because like I said, when I started, I ain't expect like motherfuckers to fuck with me like that, you feel me? I thought it was gonna just be like, I drop a couple songs, you know what I mean? But I seen like, just going like little small surrounding counties and the motherfuckers like coming up to me like, oh, you the nigga to be doing all that, that shit, you know what I mean? That shit, it inspired me to do like shit. Imagine if I really put this money behind this shit, take this shit serious, you feel me? I can get my mom out the hood, put it in a big house. No, I mean, me and my brother riding Bentley's and shit, you feel me? Facts, facts. So, uh, you say you taking it seriously, and I know you made a song with Pugatti not too long ago. Yeah. Trap. Yeah. So, yeah. how you gonna do that? Is you gonna go your own little way? Or no, I mean, shit, I'm gonna still do one thing, again, do that same thing, you feel me? Shout out Trap, shout out Pugatti, you know what I mean? The whole AG, TCG, all that. They gang, that's Brody's and them, but you feel me? Like, all of us do our own little thing, though, but they ain't really like. Really like no group thing where like we need a deal as a group and no shit like this. Like shit, whoever we got down, get the first deal, like we gone regardless, you feel me? But I'm gonna start dropping more so niggas and start feeling me more so they don't make it seem like I need other motherfuckers on my shit just to make a song, you feel me? Because I'm like that when it comes to that shit, you feel me? For sure, for sure. So uh, now I see you got a couple face tags. I see you got a hand tag. You know what I'm saying? Explain that. How that yeah, go? Yeah. Oh shit. The face tags. It was just like I mean, I always told myself I never do this shit. But you feel me? One of my shits. One of my face tags. Shit. My daughter name. I got my wife name. Keep pointing them out for me. Yeah. Like, my daughter name. My wife name. I got thirties because I'm big HMC. Big crib. You feel me? I got the wheelchair. Cause I'm rolling. You feel me? So. Other than that, though, that shit just, it's just a symbol of goddamn going through a lot, and that's just something I wanted to do, you feel me? Like, to get over pain or some shit like that, so I just rocked out. Okay, for sure, for sure. Alright, for sure, man. So, uh, in one of your songs, you said, what one was it, All My Guys? Yeah, 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 yeah. You said, you had said, uh, they say I switched. How did I speak on that? Like, I mean, shit, I spoke on that because, like, you feel me, like, and when you get when you get to a point of age, it's like you can hang with who you want to hang with. You feel me? So like, it's not just like side things. Like far as like just like one certain side like that I'm on or whatever. It's just also shit like nigga. If you feel like I switch, I switch. But I'ma let it be known, like nigga, like I'm here. I'ma stand to toes, whatever I go through or whatever. But you know what I mean? Fuck niggas gonna do, do what they do. But so uh, you said who said you switched? A lot, of, niggas, a lot of lame ass niggas, niggas that ain't even working no shine in my interview and shit like that. Niggas corny. But you know, fuck them though. So, for sure. So, uh, you say you're gonna take this rap shit seriously, you're about to get back on the rap shit. Yeah, yeah, Can you yeah. You see I yourself in five years, like how this rap shit? Shit, five years, man, shit, man. It ain't no telling, bro. Like, even if it ain't just rap, like, I'm gonna be somewhere though. Mm -hmm. Know what I mean? I just see myself five years really being able to say, I put my family in the house or something, know what I mean? Kids straight, know what I mean? Mom straight, brother straight, gang straight, you feel me? But then I'm really just focused on me and my family, really, you feel me? Making sure they get out the hood, and make sure they always got what they need or whatever. So I'm gonna make sure they good anytime, whenever, you feel me? Yeah, man, shouts out to V1 Visions. Hey, look, V1 Visions, if you ain't watching that, then you ain't watching shit, nigga.